In this lesson, we are going to take a look at the list command and how we can use it to report drawing object properties. While there are several different measuring tools that are available in AutoCAD, sometimes it might be more efficient to use a command such as list, which will tell us several bits of information at once. The list command is located on the Home tab in the Properties panel dropdown. Here you can select list. You can also type li, then press enter at your keyboard. After selecting list, I can select on any object or multiple objects, then press enter. After pressing enter, it brings up the expanded AutoCAD text window where I can learn more about the object. As you can see, it will tell me what type of object it was, in this case a circle, what layer it was drawn in, and the fact that it was drawn in model space. It also gives me the center point, as well as the radius, circumference, and area values. So again, I could have found that information using other commands, but this let me find all that information at once. I'll press F2 to toggle off my text window and take a look at another type of object, in this case, a line. I'll begin the list command again, select the line, then press enter. Once more, you can see I get the standard information, what type of object it is and what layer it was drawn in. But in the case of a line, I get to see the XY coordinates of its vertices, and I also get to see the length and the angle in the XY plane. I also get the delta or the change in the X direction and the Y direction as well. We'll look at one more object type. Again, I'll press F2 to toggle that off, choose the list command again, and this time I will choose a polyline, then press enter. As you can see, it's going to give me the XY coordinates of all the vertices. So if you have a very complex polyline with lots of vertices, this can get kind of messy. But you can also see that this is a quick way that I can find the area or perimeter of an object as well. To summarize, while we have lots of different measuring commands, many times you can use the list command to find all of that information at once. That concludes this look at the list command in AutoCAD.